bed, don't be shy Jolene can't wait to meet you For a trailer park Christmas The trailer park way With a brand new recipe Every day Sending videos from her trailer She's Jolene Sugar Baker. She is Jolene Sugar Baker. Come and spend the holidays the trailer park trailer way. Park Merry trailer park Merry Christmas. Trailer park Christmas. Merry trailer park Christmas. Hooray! Well, hi there, trailer park fans. It's Jolene Sugar Baker, the trailer park queen. And welcome to the Trailer Park Test Kitchen. And welcome to Trailer Park Christmas 2019, where I'm showing you how the Trailer Park celebrates a holiday. Well, I'm so excited, I've got a recipe or a craft or even a chat every day until December 25th. And I've got a calendar that you can follow along at TrailerParkChristmas.com. And I see today that it's a cookie recipe and I'm excited to share this one because it's great for a cookie swap or you can take it to the office. And this one is surprising because it's got chocolate on the top and it's cherry filled and the cherry has chocolate in it too. It's magical, it's trailer park style. It's up next on Trailer Park Christmas 2019. I'll be right back. Welcome back. Making my chocolate covered cherry cookies is really simple and I've got 24 Maroschino cherries which make the best Shirley Temple drinks that we all know and love around the holidays. I've got them without the juice right here on some paper towels and I'm just going to blot them and dry them off and we're just going to set these aside once we dry them off and we're just going to roll up the paper towel just like this and we're going to use those in just a bit so let's just put them right there and we're going to take a bowl here and we're going to take a half cup of butter and three-fourth cup of brown sugar and we're going to cream this together until it's nice and fluffy so i'll check back with you in just a moment next up you're going to add a teaspoon of vanilla extract and you know i don't measure that yet and we're just going to dump that right on into the bowl and one eighth teaspoon of salt right on into the bowl just like that and i've got one and a half cups of all-purpose flour and we're just going to mix this together until it's well mixed so i'll check back with you in just a moment while you're mixing it around add one tablespoon of the cherry juice right on in there into the mixture okay now that you got a dough together you're going to pop it in the fridge for about an hour until it's uh, nice and firm and you're going to be able to use it to make the cookies so i'll check back with you in just a moment Okay, now I've got a baking pan here, and I've got our dried off cherries and our dough. And what we're going to do, and I know this sounds strange, but we've got where the cherry stem was. We're going to take a chocolate chip, and we're going to push it through that stem area right on into the cherry and just tuck it right on into there. And then we're going to take a, oh, about a tablespoon of the dough. And we're going to wrap it around the cherry just like this so it goes all the way around the cherry and you may need just a little bit more to do that yet and there we go and i'm going to put that on the ungreased cookie tray here and i'm going to finish a few more here and i'll check back with you in just a moment Okay, I've got a pan here ready for the oven, and I've preheated it to 350 degrees. And they're going to bake for about 15 to 17 minutes. They're going to brown around the edges, and we're going to set our timer. After the cookies have cooled, you're going to take the rest of the chocolate chips and a half teaspoon of shortening here, and you're going to pop it in the microwave, and you're going to uh, melt it down until they're smooth and you're going to dip the cookies in them, actually the tops, and they're going to look real pretty. So we're going to do that in a bit too. So I'll check back with you in just a moment.
And there you have it, my chocolate covered cherry cookies. And look at that, we dipped them in the chocolate there and they sure do look cute. They would look great on some sort of cookie platter or if you took them to the office and put them out on a plate, people will be like, wow, that is a fancy cookie. And we know that they have a secret cherry inside of them and I can't wait to try them. So let me just bite into this one here. Mmm, that is very good. Mmm, that kind of tastes like the chocolate chip kind of batter. And it has that cherry inside. And it's like a miracle. It's got that chocolate inside of the cherry. And then it has the chocolate up on top. And it's just chocolate everywhere with this cookie. Wow, that is so good. I hope you get a chance to make my chocolate covered cherry cookies with the surprise cherry in the middle. That is, that is an inventive. I'm, I should put a patent on that or something. And if you do, send me pictures at joleensugarbaker at gmail.com. Don't forget to follow me all over the place. I'm on Instagram and I'm on Facebook. And don't forget to download the calendar at trailerparkchristmas.com where you can follow along all the way until the 25th. There's a video every day. And I see tomorrow that it's something controversial and it's a cheesy pineapple side dish. I know it's a country favorite and some of y'all have to learn about it. It's Trailer Park Christmas where I show you how the trailer park celebrates the holiday. I love spending the holidays with you. I'll see you back tomorrow. Merry Trailer Park Christmas. Bye-bye. Slap on all your blue eyeshadow. Watch out for